All righty, so we have a really cool update for you guys today. The restaurant is well on its way in terms of construction. And for those of you who have seen photos of the farmhouse at Cedar Point, can truly understand what to expect with this new restaurant. When we told you that it's going to look like a five-star restaurant um, at Canada's Wonderland, we meant it. Um, so really excited for you guys to see some of the things, especially the canoes. Um, but yeah, there's some other weird activity going on. They're finally dismantling this weird, like, um, what do you call them? A construction trailer behind Splash Ricks. It's been there since, like, the Paramount days. But yeah, it's finally being dismantled for some odd reason. Um, I guess just to get rid of it instead of moving it, they could just dismantle it and get rid of the wood. That's easier. Um, for no apparent reason, there's nothing to that. But yeah, the uh, as you can see here, the Pizza Pizza has been expanded uh, for better capacity. The park is expanding a lot of its capacity um, in terms of being able to handle food and crowds. Um, Cedar Fair did say on their stockholders call that they are getting their parks ready for mobile ordering. Um, and it makes sense Wonderland's going to take a couple years to get ready for that. Um, here, uh, I can't tell if Dragonfire's train is back on the track yet. I tried to zoom in and even was zooming in. It does look like there is a train in the station, but I'm not fully sure. But it looks like it is. Um, I was told that the train should be up this weekend. And if not this weekend, they'll definitely be up by Wednesday operations or Thursday oper operations next week. Um, but it should be up and running um, for this weekend is what I've been told. Uh, but yeah, as you can see on the far left of the back side of that building, you're going to see cement. Um, that is going to be a patio on top of the building. Uh, so that is going to be amazing. That's going to be my lounge spot. Um, for those of you who don't know, I literally sat on the lounge chairs, the Muskoka chairs by Flying Canoes for five and a half hours on Sunday and just relaxed. And I ended up actually catching someone stealing and getting the cops involved and they got arrested. Um, but nonetheless, it was eventful, and my new favorite thing is to just lounge at Wonderland, so I will be up there uh, just relaxing. Um, so hopefully they put Muskoka chairs up there. But nonetheless, if you're paying attention, there's a lot of detail in this building, um, and there's even a river at the bottom that they've created, and the electrical green box has been installed over there by uh, the turnaround of Vortex. But very cool things. Just wanted to give you guys a really quick update uh, before the park opens this weekend again. Uh, have an amazing weekend, guys. Bye.